Mark Hitchcock is the author, and Blood Moons Rising is the book. He is our guest all this month on 100 Huntley Street. We are deep in the weeds of prophecy, but there's nothing that's boring about it. Uh, we left last time talking about the Antichrist. What's the Bible tell us the Antichrist um, is, is going to be like, or what are the characteristics? You, you mentioned last segment that he's described as the little horn. Mm -hmm. So someone right now that's not very well known, mm -hmm. if, if indeed uh, this is the era in which the Antichrist is about to rise, but what are some other clearer definitions of the Antichrist? Well, the Antichrist, I think, is going to rise from this reunited Roman Empire. Again, we don't know what country for sure he's coming from, but we know he's going to come out of this uh, reunited Roman Empire. I think he's going to be a Gentile. Um, you know, the early church believed he was going to be a Jew. Many of them did. But he rises up in Revelation 13 out of the sea, which speaks of the sea of nations. The only uh, type or foreshadow of the Antichrist in the Bible is a man named Antiochus Epiphanes back in the book of, of Daniel. And he was a Gentile. And also the Antichrist is going to lead the final form of Gentile world power. And he's going to be a great persecutor of the Jewish people, which seems odd to me if he's a Jew for him to be persecuting the Jews. Great point. So I think he's going to be a, a Gentile. He's going to be someone, though, who's going to come on the scene as a great peacemaker. And you think about what does the world want today more than anything else? Someone who can bring peace to the world, peace and prosperity. And that's, what, that's going to be his platform and his promise. And he's going to do that for some period of time. But uh, at some point in time, the, the iron fist inside the velvet glove is going to be, going to be unveiled. And he will be the most iron-fisted, uh, egomaniacal ego leader the world has ever seen. And Mark, you can see the way the world is today with instantaneous communication, oh, yeah. how very quickly news can spread and power can be established and influence can be made just because of media platforms. That's right. The globalism we see today is setting the stage for him to come on the scene and the technology that's available today because the technology available today allows someone to keep track of where people are and to know what people are doing. So all these things we see coming together really fit uh, what the Bible says about a coming world ruler who's going to come on the scene. More about the Antichrist when we're back, and we're also going to talk in our next segment about the Mark of the Beast. It's going to get more and more compelling.